Welcome to iCombat. In today's video, we're going to go over how to create a session in your session calendar. First, you want to log in to your company user account on barracks.icombat.com. Once you're done with that, we're going to click on Sessions, Calendar. We want to make a new session for today and next week. So we'll click Create Session. Now, the session type here is a pre-configured setting to better understand session types, see our session types tutorial. So for this event, we want it to be a public event. The session category is a tag for grouping data on reports and dashboards. Categories can be managed under configurations and session configurations. So for this one, it's just a public session, so we'll select public. We're gonna call this the 3 p.m. public. And we want this to end next week, so today is February 5th. We want this to go to February 12th. Now the date range, obviously you have your start date and your end date. I only want this session to be active for two weeks, so we set our date range for the 5th and the 12th. If you leave it blank, it will be reoccurring until you pick an end date for that session. At the time, we will select the 3 p.m. time slot. If we have multiple fields, we would select which field this session will be played on. Right now we only have one field, field A. The cost, keep it at 30. The cost is set to the currency that is configured under your location profile. Refer to the tutorial on configuring online payments. So we'll leave this set to $30. Duration, this is how many minutes your players will be out on your field. And the number of slots. The minimum slot set to one means a player only has to reserve one slot to make the reservation. The maximum slot sets to 30, which means the session will not accept any more than 30 reservation slots. So if all this looks good, we'll hit create. And now we'll go look at it on our calendar. As you can see, we have the 3 p.m. public session. We'll look at the following week. We can see it's there too. And on the 12th, it stopped like it was supposed to. We want to edit this session because we think we're gonna have a few more people come this week. So we'll click on this little pencil. And now it's going to bring us to this edit window. We can select to edit all occurrences of this session or just edit this particular one. We don't want to change everything, so we're just going to edit this one. We want to change the cost, so we'll do $25. And we want to pack it full, so we'll try and get 40 people in there. And we'll hit update. View it on our calendar. Now you can see on the 5th, we have 30 reser zero of 30 reservations. Now you can see the changes here for the reservations. This concludes our create session tutorial. 